Hello everyone. Uh, this time I will show you how to troubleshoot the user account lockout issue. Sometimes, you know, every 90 days by default, the user password will be expired and the user will need to change the password. Sometimes when user change the password, the user account keeps locked out. So we are, you know, check do the troubleshooting for how to fix this user account keeps knockout issue so normally we need to do a few things if we log into i'm logged into the uh, domain controller so the very first thing we need to find out if when the user password is changed so we can run the command net user then username and if we run this command we see this password last set is today at 7 18 a.m so this is what we we find out the user has recently reset his password and the next one we need to uh, run the you know logout status normally we can find this application from google just uh, google lockout status download and then we can download the you know download the application after we download and run it i already downloaded this one logout status dot msi when i after i run it i can see this logout status is uh, installed on the server so if we go to this one go to uh, this tools this lockout status so I also run the lockout status and then if I just uh, select target and put the username and then click OK you see this one says at this time today at line 35 uh, 52 this user account has a bad password inputted so we go the next we go to the event log we go to the event log go to security and uh, find this time you see this audit failure we find this one and then we see this if we double click the audit failure We see this user has input the wrong password, and uh, the this one is login client computer ID is one seventy. This IP address, and this the uh, failure code is OX eighteen. OX eighteen means you know is wrong password. We can also try to find the failure code for the you know four double seven one event log event. So if we just check, I just open this one. Uh, for the event, this uh, 18 is a bad password. Normally, we will see lots of OX12. This means the you know, password is locked out, uh, user account locked out. But we need to find out the OX18 is means bad password. If we find this uh, user IP address, and also we find this uh you know bad password then we can go to the dns the dns find out this ip address is pointing to the, this computer w10-01 then we what we can do is we can go to the power share and then we can uh, run the session Query space session space forward slash several colon w pen dash zero one. We press this one and then we see there is a session on this computer. Joseph D. This means he has not logged out of the computer before he changed the password. So I mean after he changed the password he says is still a session on this computer so what we can do is we can just uh, run the another command
So you see this session ID, session ID is three. We just put the three session ID. And then put the, this command to log the user out, log user off from the computer. can uh, check the session again on the remote computer. So we run the command again, query session. We see this you know, user Joseph Dottony is already signed out from this uh, computer, which has caused the bad password issue. So this issue should be fixed now after we log the user off from the you know, disconnect session from the remote computer. Thank you, thanks.